Dominic and Lex here. Hey everyone. How's it going guys? So tonight. Woohoo! <laughs> okay, that's a new one. Tonight we're going to do a, um, this is a Dan request for Narvik. Yes. Thank you so much Narvik for being a uh, Dan member. And uh, so uh, being a Dan member gives you a guaranteed song mm -hmm. once per month. Mm -hmm. So which one are we talking about? We are doing something from the group Keldian. Um, this song is called Redshift from their Heaven's Gate album 2007. Um, this song is uh, what Narvik gave us uh, some sort of description. And I do remember reading that. About and the he, train. He said that this is going to be the first of this genre that we're going to be covering. Space rock. Yep, space mm -hmm. rock. And yes, that this is uh, describing basically the moment that you are saying goodbye to someone Forever. without knowing or knowing that there is no return. So he did describe like, imagine you're sitting at a train station and the train is leaving and someone you love is on there. And you see the train and then you see the back of the train and then you see the train very small and you only see basically what? The lights. The lights. That are left and then, behind. So and I've done that. Yeah. I've been at, at a train station. In that moment. And when somebody leaves, like it was my brother or some friend and I've done that with cars with planes with Toby, been... yes that happened no when you like said goodbye and you didn't know yeah. when that was well I, he was not on it he was walking so i was yeah. just from my window he, i think watching. just use the train as an example because mm -hmm. the actual situation is that it's an astronaut leaving mm -hmm. saying goodbye knowing he's never coming back to earth so okay. in that like he used the train as like an example that yeah, yeah, yeah. someone could relate to and I think you told me with Tobias, you said goodbye from the back of the car, right? So it's no, like... No, with Tobias, we said goodbye, and then I looked out of my the kitchen window, oh, and I could see kitchen. him basically walking the street, oh. and then for like three minutes he was walking, and then he turned, and then I didn't see him for like... Um, the good thing is I did go back to Germany, but then when I said goodbye, the second time I haven't seen him in, yeah. I don't know since then like forever but the cool thing is we do message almost on a daily basis mm -hmm. because of the internet <laughs> but, <laughs> Thank but yeah but i mean when that. we were kids when we were you know 14 years old that was that was heavy yeah you know, oh yeah i'm sure to go through yeah but this is just knowing this information is great um but and we also know the genre is space rock that's all we know. I've never heard the name Keldian before. No, you, not no. anything that like in space would rock. Ring a bell. I've seen some stuff that could be space rock, but I've never really known the genre. But me we neither. Will find I'm that. unfamiliar with that as well. But let's get started. I'm very excited. Thank you, Narvik, for all of your support on the channel, uh, for being like Nick said, a Dan member. I'm excited about this choice and all the others. You always have great taste. So. Let's yeah. see what the future holds. So it's this one here, right? <laughs> yes. Okay. Thank you again. Yay! Apollo 13. Yes, Apollo he said that. 11. Really cool chords. Mm -hmm. So we're leaving you behind. 
footprints on your shores, washed away forevermore. Looking at you one last time, I stare with As the sky draws your gaze Did you get to say goodbye? Did you see her sad face? your gaze Did you get to say goodbye Did you see her sad face The planet below will soon disappear into space And now when you close your eyes you will see Falling Very good. Wow. Yes. Very, very good. I love that. It, it is very, um, so space rock, I don't think it's because it's about space, mm -hmm. but I think space rock, um, if this is the definition of space rock, I mean, it's very keyboard heavy, mm -hmm. you know, very, a lot of atmospheres yes. and stuff. And but I love the whole singing, and I I love that he gave us the background, the background because I was because, very focused on that. Yeah, which is almost kind of weird because <laughs> I usually never focus on yeah. the lyrics that much, 
But it was easy to focus because the music was very easy to And the to voice was to. very nice, yeah. very pleasant to focus on. It, it yeah. wasn't something that I wanted to, um, I don't know, drown out or something, uh-huh. you know? It, no, but it the, was no, easy the thing to follow was along. very good. Yeah. And um, I love the guitar solo at the end. Mm-hmm. Dramatic. It was just like, yes. okay, this person is like... Or we're leaving yes. the planet behind. Never to touch this ground again. Yeah, it's yeah, like, yeah. Oh, and then it's like so, would so, be hard soon to do. though the planet will be lost and not lost in space, but just like well, you're flying away yeah. from it. But yeah, no. But the music though was very nice. It was just very new age. Mm-hmm. I think it felt new age because it was very keyboard heavy. Mm-hmm. A lot of atmospheres, some kind of like organ effects yeah. there like church organ you mm-hmm. know but usually just like the synth yes and but I everything just... was very soft boom, 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 very boom, boom, like boom, 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 you know boom, boom, easy boom, 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 to yeah like easy to digest a very yeah. good song i think i mean it's a it's a sad song especially the solo at the end is almost like you know mm-hmm. yeah you know, like it's a... you can feel the pain yeah, <laughs> yeah, yeah so but very cool i did mm-hmm. enjoy it very very much i can't wait to you know, to check out more space rock. Yeah. Or maybe even from the um from this album. When is this? 2007? 2007. Mm-hmm. Yeah, it was very interesting. Very different. This was what I like about the channel that you just like, just a couple of days ago, I did all these 60s instrumental um, uh, tracks. Tracks. And it was so, so interesting. Mm-hmm. And uh, so, yeah, every time we learn something more today, we did some... <laughs> Janice Joplin for the first time and it was just insane so thank you so much for just like um, feeding us with new information new music but what did you think overall about Space Rock I liked it 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 was enjoyable it was definitely um, the fact that it is on the softer side at least this track um was nice because it was just peaceful and Mm. I could just sit back and focus on the subject material, you know, like the, yeah, not necessarily every single lyric because I don't really remember, but just putting that moment that Narvik kind of like (laughs) yeah planted planted in my brain of like saying goodbye to someone and then, just thinking like, wow, this music really goes with that. It, yes. it does give me that vibe and it does. and put me in that in that position without necessarily focusing on every single letter of every mm-hmm. word, you know. True. Um, I was able to kind of put the two together. So that was very nice. Thank you, Narvik, for doing that. <laughs> <laughs> Alarms galore. <laughs> no, I'm just Sorry. kidding. Um, but yeah, e- either way, we um, are so appreciative of you and all of the support that you yes. have given to the channel. Uh, we wish you safe travels always. Um, we hope that everyone enjoyed this. Let us know what you think. Yeah. If this was your first time listening to Keldian, what's your experience with them or Space Rock or anything that you have to say about the song? Um Please let us know. Give us a like if you liked it. Uh, Support the bands that we show here as well. Uh, But we hope to see you all in the next one. Thank you, guys. Bye, everyone. Bye.